senior security advisor at Trend Micro. He joins me now via webcam from England. Rick, once this worm gets into your computer, what can it do? Well, uh, in terms of what it's going to do on April the 1st, it's really anybody's guess. The worst case is that the outside estimates of the numbers of infected machines are true, and that's multiple millions. Um, and we could, for example, drown under a deluge of spam. We could have, uh, alongside that spam, a, a vast number of um, previously unknown machines that are now infected, hosting malicious software, which will create a vicious circle of more people getting infected. Now, this is specifically targeting Microsoft users. Microsoft is telling its users to head to search.live.com. I have that pulled up here where it says you can get a free PC safety scan. But if my computer's infected, I might have a problem getting to this site, correct? That's right. One of the things that the, the latest variant um, of this worm does is it blocks access to a large number of security-related and cleanup-related websites, one of those being safety.live.com. And being that it comes out on April 1st, any possibility that this is some sort of uh, hacker's hoax? No, the, the people behind this software are very skilled programmers and they're very well informed. We've seen them incorporate updates uh, using latest encryption technology literally as it was released within this worm. So these are very skilled cyber criminals. All right, Rick Ferguson, the senior security advisor at Trend Micro. Appreciate your time. Thanks for talking to me via webcam Thank as you. we keep an eye on the Configure worm expected to activate on April 1st. From the CNN Center, I'm Errol Varnett.